This image here brings you to the Port of Miami. What's happening here is if you can envision a wall of police officers in riot gear and 500 people protesting for George Floyd. One of the police officers got on a bullhorn and told a crowd of people, everyone needs to clear this area in two minutes or you're all gonna be arrested. Okay, so what happens? Everybody starts to scatter. But in that moment, this gentleman doesn't leave. So you have him on his bicycle with his sign that says, I can't breathe. Me standing in front of him and then the wall of police behind me. So then I said to myself, well, if he's not gonna move, then I'm not gonna move because neither one of us can breathe. He represents pain, struggling, suffering. I think he's powerful. Most of the people I photograph are strangers, but even though they're strangers because I don't know them personally, the foundation of the struggle that they're in, that I'm in, that we're all in, is what connects us. History Miami Museum has been so amazing with allowing me to showcase my work here to get the message out because this exhibition, Capture, A Portrait of the Pandemic, is not about me. It's about Miami, it's about my city, it's about my community, and it's about essentially the country and the world and what we're going through as a human race.